Senorita Latina, who's that girl? <laughs> it's been a while. I get it. Four weeks, five weeks, something like that. I did, you know, snipe the uh, Sensi CEO's video and put it on my channel, monetize. But other than that, have I made a video? No. I have a massive bag of empties over there that is just ridiculous. Uh, I'm kind of making this for my VIPs, although my VIP group has like disintegrated into nothing. Sensi has taken such a back seat and I feel so bad about it. There's a mess back there, whatever. Sensi has taken such a back seat for the first time in the eight years, 10 years really, that I've been a Sensi consultant. For the first two, obviously you guys know, whatever, if you've been to my channel for any amount of time, you know that the first two years I was just fucking off. And then in 2016, I really amped it up and became a full-time Sensi consultant pretty much. Um, and now life has just changed. Everybody has seasons. But this was just delivered to my house. And I'm going to try to describe it as best as I can. It almost looks like a piece of, of candy. Like, um, this looks like, you know, a piece of candy with paper that's tied at the end. I don't know what this is supposed to represent. I've never seen a Harry Potter movie. I might have put it on for my kids and then walked out of the room. That's as close as watching a Harry Potter movie that, that I've gotten um, and I've never read any of the books. Sue me, whatever. Um... But anyway, this came to my house, so we're going to talk about it. Maribel is one of my best customers left. <laughs> one of my only customers left. Anyway, she's local to me, and she's a Patty, Patty Hotter. Harry Potter freak. <clears throat> and she did get the warmer. The warmer is sitting over there. I'm not going to unbox it because it's hers. It's very beautiful. I'll put a picture of her right over here. Um, but she asked me about the, the wax. Now, she and I have very similar taste in wax. Floral, perfumey, uh, so a little bit manly, not too aquatic, not too bakery, right? And so, I don't know, the, 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 I can't get the fucking thing open. Pardon my French. How do I open this? I'm like, try, oh, okay. So it opens up like this. Ah, and then there's the uh, descriptions there, but still, how do I get the wax out? Um, I guess I should have watched an unboxing by somebody else. I didn't realize that I, I'm going to have to destroy this thing. I don't know how else to, um, open it. I don't think I was supposed to open it that way. I, I thought they were just going to sort of, oh, they are, they're coming out these, this way. Are they coming out this way? Oh my God, Sensi, really? Sensi spent more on the uh, on the packaging. Okay, there's four bars of wax in here. After I ripped it there, I then realized that I just had to be patient. Whatever. I, I'm not, it's not going, they're not going back in here. Okay, it's called Honey Dukes Sensi Wax Collection. It's only $24 for four bars of wax, which means that these are $6 a piece. You cannot buy them separately. I don't think. Hold on. It smells good already, even though these are all, uh, yeah, you cannot buy them separately. Um, so it, you have to spend the $24, but if you have a friend, you can always split it. Or you can um, ha you can check up on your local Sensi consultants to see if they're willing to split them up. I would be willing to split this up with Maribel. Anyway, let's look through them. Cauldron Cakes is the first one. It's a cauldron, obviously, which Harry Potter, whatever. Uh, and sorry, the landscapers are here, but I've got to do this because literally the first time I've had an opportunity to make a Scentsy video in five or six weeks. Cauldron Cakes is described as cinnamon sugar, vanilla bean, enchanted spice vanilla cake. This smells very autumn-y. I kind of like it a lot. Um, it's, it is vanilla and it is cinnamon. It's cinnamon sugar. It almost smells like a uh, cinnamon toast crunch. But cereal is a very specific fragrance with home fragrance, a very specific note to home fragrance, and it doesn't have the cereal note, but it reminds me of the Cinnamon Toast Crunch um, shaker stuff that you can buy in the, in, if you look in the spice aisle where the cinnamon is, there's a Cinnamon Toast Crunch stuff, and my son puts it on his oatmeal. It's basically just cinnamon sugar. Anyway, I like that. 
Don't know if Maribel's gonna like that. Anyway, I'll, I'll stop bringing her up, whatever. Exploding bonbons. Exploding bonbons. It's a real boom. There we go. It's very pretty packaging. Ooh, juicy orange, white chocolate, and sweet vanilla. My mouth just watered. Focus. Uh, juicy orange, white chocolate, sweet vanilla burst from candied pineapple. Get out. So it's a lot of fruit. I like this a lot. It smells like... Oh, can you see them? Do you see the birds? Can you see them? They're bumpy. Hello, birds. Right there. Hold on. Let me see if I can do it. Right at the tip of my finger, there's a bird feeder. One of those clear plexiglass bird feeders that suction cup to the outside window. And we put it up two days ago. And oh my God, the birds are going crazy. But unfortunately, it's the freaking morning doves. The big ass birds like this. They're fighting over it. Anyway. Exploding bonbons smells like uh, a creamsicle, but not in that disgusting, nauseating St. Joseph's aspirin way. Juicy orange, yes. White chocolate, yes. Sweet vanilla, candy pineapple. Not so much pineapple. I don't really smell the pineapple, but I do smell the orange and I like this. So far two for two. Nothing is going into my Scentsy Club. I'll tell you that right now. Just from reading the descriptions, I know that. Fizzing Wisbees. Don't know what the fuck that means. Cho Chocolate dipped strawberries sparkle with apple, melon, apple, melon, and sugared coconut. Chocolate dipped strawberries. I like the idea of that. We have a couple of uh, senses, a couple of fragrances that are chocolate and strawberry mixed together. What the uh, Big Hero 6 had a little bit of a chocolate covered strawberry thing. And also um, love... Oh, what the hell was the name of that one? Everybody's screaming. It's bright red wax. Deep, deep, bright red wax. Love. Not it's love. Damn it. I'm never going to remember. <laughs> All right. Chocolate dipped strawberries. Apple, melon, sugared coconut. Ooh, this is interesting. I like the chocolate. It has the chocolate. You wouldn't think of it with that color. Oh, my God. This is good. I'm not going to warm it. I'm going to ask Maribel if she wants this. It's really interesting. It's chocolate and strawberry. I don't smell apple. I don't really smell water, uh, melon. And the coconut, very slight. It reminds me, and it doesn't smell like it at all, but... The amount of coconut in this smells like the amount of coconut that's in um, the Friends Wax. That's like a chocolate coffee coconut smell it's a little like that but not it doesn't have any coffee in it intriguing three for three this one uh, this one is gonna be boring as shit it's called sherbet lemon or sherbet lemon uh and it's not even a like trademarked bar but for some reason it's still six bucks because it's in this whatever packaging it is Sparkling sugar uplifts bright notes of orange, lime, and candied lemon. We have had this fragrance a thousand times. Um, and I don't mind it. Lemon sherbet, sherbet, whatever, is very similar to lemon sorbet. I'm sure it's going to smell just like that. Yeah, it's very lemony, though, which is nice. It does have orange, lime, and candied lemon. Wow, it's pretty strong, though. That's, oh, wow. All right. <laughs> I like this collection. It doesn't have any of the Metalcomon stuff, though. It, there's not one perfumey fragrance in here. But I like it. It's eclectic. Even though it's all gourmand, it's like it's got the rainbow of gourmand. I really like this. If you, like, squeeze the day... Oh, man! I'm just going to keep on saying things and then going back on my word. I love this. I absolutely love this. Um, should I order another? I, have not, I haven't even had time to warm wax. 
I'm going to ask uh, Maribel if she wants the fizzing Wisbees because that's the chocolate dip strawberry one. And I think that, that that might be my favorite. Although the sherbet lemon, the one that I was shitting on immediately, <laughs> really made an impact in my nose. Know what I'm saying? Anyway, 10 minutes. Let's wrap this up. I'm not even going to um, edit it in any way. Um, you know what? Fuck it. I'm just going to put this right up on YouTube. It's not going to have an intro. It's not going to have an outro. My name is Andrea. I am still a Sensi consultant. I promise. Um, I am still actually a director, which is pretty amazing, but that has to do with my team. That doesn't have to do with me. That, and listen, if you're not a Sensi consultant, you don't care what my rank is, but I'm coveting it. I have not been, I have been paid at at least director every single month since August of 2017. Not a lot of people can say that. Anyway, <laughs> enough of the bragging. I like this. This is the uh, Huckabees, no, Honey Dukes, Huckabees. This is the Honey Dukes collection from the Harry Potter uh, stuff. Um, it's only $24. That's a deal. Get it. Go to metallicamom.sensi.us and click on collections and click on Harry Potter and click on that and click on cart and click on pay. I dare you.